Thomas and the Missing Rabbit. It was a beautiful, it was a beautiful Easter day on the island of Sodor. Thomas was excited because he got to do something special. He, Thomas needed to do a job for, for Glacier Park. Thomas needed to... Sir Topham Hatt had chosen Thomas to take the Sodor Animal... To, to take the Sodor Animal Park rabbit from the, from the animal park to the zoo. From the animal park, from the animal park to the, to the Glacier Park Petting Zoo. Thomas was so happy, he thought his boiler would burst. Thomas's fireman was putting the bunny on the flatbed. We need to go, said Thomas. I have to be careful with the bunny, he said. He placed him on, but then the conductor accidentally blew his whistle. Shh! No, I don't mean that, he yelled. Beep, beep! Thomas was ready to go. Hold on, Thomas, he said. The bunny, the bunny. The conductor blew his whistle, said Thomas. We are going. It was an accident. He didn't mean to do it, said his driver. Oh, don't be silly, said Thomas. Thomas was huffing and puffing along the line. A weird, a weird animal was in the, an animal. There were, there was turtles by the water. Thomas looked at himself in the water. Then he didn't see his water reflection of the coaches of his troublesome truck. Oh no, said Thomas. We left him behind. We left the truck behind. We left the truck behind, he said. Don't worry, Thomas. Let's back up and try again. Thomas needed help. But, but, but by the time they got back, the bunny had broken through the cage and ran across the line. They don't know where it is. Oh no, said Thomas. I'm a very silly engine of listening to the conductor. I'm sorry, Thomas, said the conductor. I just got startled over a, um, over a loud noise. That's all right, said Thomas, but we're trying again. Thomas coupled onto the coach, and the and a new cage was loaded, and he drove away. I have to find Harold. I have to find Harold, he said. When Thomas reached Harold, he was relaxing at the search and rescue center. Beep, beep, said Thomas. Help me. I lost the soda animal bunny. Did you lose it? Did you make a bad mistake? Harold said. No, said Thomas. The conductor accidentally blew his whistle when everything wasn't ready yet. Oh dear, said Harold. I'm I'm going to follow me wherever I go. I will see. I will find out where it is. Harold flew up, and he flew. Harold went up and flew away. To find the rabbit. Thomas was right behind him. <laughs> Meanwhile, Percy was was on his way to Glacier Park. He peep he would peep his home. He was having he saw Gigano Pit the kisses that were being brought back to Glacier Park from their escape. Beep beep answered Percy. The Gigano Pit the Kiss clapped its hand. The Gigano Pit the Kiss roared in its cage. He wants to say hello to you too, Percy, the, the animal control said. Percy was huffing along the bridge until suddenly he saw something on the bridge. His driver saw it too. 
and so Percy applied the brakes. It was a rabbit on the line. The rabbit had broken out of the rabbit was the Sodor Animal Park Bunny. Shouldn't Thomas be pulling you? said Percy. The rabbit was was making rabbit noises. I don't know what a rabbit sounds like. Later, Toby was coming along the line until he saw the rabbit too. I need if you I don't want to have to run him over with my cow catchers, he said. So t Percy's driver gently grabbed the rabbit and he loaded it in Percy. And so they they needed to find Thomas. Thomas. They needed to find Thomas. <laughs> Toby was on his way to Glacier Park. Harold flew lower to warn the to see Percy to warn Percy. Percy stop, stopped him. Yes, Thomas stop. Thomas stopped where Harold stopped. Thomas said, I lost a bunny, Percy. I lost a bunny. Well, I have a passenger on board who wants to go to Glacier Park. It was the bunny. Percy's fireman was holding the rabbit in his hands. <laughs> the rabbit, this time, Thomas waited patiently. He, he was listening. He was listening. Thank you for helping me find the bunny, Harold, he said. Don't thank me. Thank Percy. We thank, don't thank me. Thank Percy, said Harold. He's the one who found it. Well, thanks anyway. I'm just kidding, said Harold. You're welcome for helping. Thank you for helping. Thank you for helping us find it, Percy. Anytime, Harold. I'll see you all at Glacier Park. <sighs> Thomas went. Thomas and Percy puffed to Glacier Park. They met Toby there. The Glacier Park, the Sodor Animal Park bunny, for this for the Easter, for the Easter, for the Easter, for the Easter lunch there has is ready. Is ready to be uh, is ready to amaze people and have people pet it and feed it. Thomas said, "I will never. I'll try my hardest not to lose a bunny ever again." <laughs> <laughs>